If presidential disgruntlement were an Olympic sport, there would be a very crowded podium with Deputy Attorney General Rod Rosenstein apparently in the hunt for a gold medal. AG Jeff Sessions' permanent and universal recusal means Ramblin' Rod is his ubiquitous stand-in. And according to the New York Times, he was so <laughs> torqued by the president, he wanted to wear a wire to catch the uncouth commander spouting untoward Trumpisms to invoke the 25th Amendment. Before he went full Omarosa, apparently <laughs> a few in the room told Cacklin Rosenstein to lock it up and bring it down a thou. And now some of the red-faced renegade's colleagues say he was just being sarcastic. There is one way to prove that. And part of it involves indulging the Freedom Caucus and their whim to bring the flustered lawman before the House Judiciary Committee, not just for an airing of grievances, but also to prove whether or not Rosenstein was really joking. Rod Rosenstein must be compelled under oath to tell his favorite joke. And if he can do it convincingly, he will not be fired. And then he should be grilled on his thin-skinned backside for being such a weenie. And then Andrew McCabe must produce the memos memorializing the conversation that either exonerate or condemn Rod the Bod. This is a time of expanded transparency, not convenient contraction that allows the perennially powerful to continuously slime their way out of desperately needed accountability. Rod, if the job don't fit, you must quit.